A very good afternoon. 80 grommets are being released across Bristol today as part of an art exhibition that's raising money for the city's children's hospital. Normally, grommet of the wrong trousers fame is small and shaped for modelling clay, but these are four feet high, made of fibreglass and have been designed by famous artists. Robert Murphy reports. To infinity and beyond. Well, to Bristol City Centre, please. This grommet light cheer was designed and painted by animators of the Toy Story films in California. Today, it was finishing its journey where it began, Bristol. 80 fiberglass grommets are being placed in Bristol landmarks. They've been designed by either famous artists or less known ones in Bristol. You know, I was a bit worried that all these uh, incredible artists, you know, that they would feel restricted. I think I would, working on somebody else's character. Uh, but they haven't, you know, they've, they've, they've just let let fly and, and gone for it and each one is so creative and and so amazing I think it's going to be a, an amazing summer uh, with grommets all around Bristol. So how do you move a load of painted grommets? Well they're currently on the back of this low loader train and soon grommets creator Nick Park's going to come along and drive that train along this track into the centre of Bristol. They'll have a quick photo opportunity and then they're going to be released across the city. The grommets will be displayed until early September. Then they'll be auctioned to raise money for the Bristol Children's Hospital. We hope that Grommet Unleashed this summer will help us to raise the much needed additional funds that we need for things like an interoperative MRI scanner, which will be the second only in the UK, and a cardiac hybrid theatre, which will be uh, the first um, in the southwest of England. A grass grommet, a gruffalo grommet, a gaudy grommet, and 77 more will be running loose in Bristol this summer. Robert Murphy, ITV.